is set to discuss the possibility of a major training operation for Ukrainian forces in nearby nations at a meeting of defense ministers next week. Training for Ukrainian soldiers in a major mission that, if it goes ahead, will take place in neighboring countries. EU Foreign Affairs Chief Joseph Borrell justified its deliberations. It seems reasonable that a war that lasts and seems to be going to last should require an effort not only in terms of equipment supplies but also in terms of training and for the organization of the army and this is what is being discussed among the member states and will be discussed politically next week next Monday in Prague within the Council of Defense Ministers and I hope that it will be approved Meanwhile, as the war rumbles on, President Vladimir Putin chose National Flag Day to hail Russia's military glory and upholding our traditional values. The national flag, like the unfading red banner of victory, serves to educate the younger generation about the values of patriotism, citizenship and responsibility for the future of the motherland. Back in Ukraine, there is no respite. Kiev acknowledged on Monday that nearly 9,000 soldiers have been killed since the start of the conflict. And, despite pleas from the international community, bombs have fallen again near the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant.